Ladies and gentlemen, please watch as the Miami Lighthouse for the Blind introduces Beep Baseball to blind children, thanks to the Miami Marlins. I am visually impaired. I had a disease called retinoblastoma. How could I be able to play baseball? Why do I have to be visually impaired? But the Miami Lighthouse for the Blind is getting them off the bench and in the game with Beep Baseball. If you like, you could play Beep Baseball. It's really fun. A lot of times it's like, ah, ha, I can do this. So how do you play Beep Baseball? Since we can't see, we have double listening skills. All the senses move to take one sense in place. All of the children, totally blind or partially blind, have the option of wearing a blindfold. He asked me, do even the blind children need to wear a blindfold? And I answered him, absolutely, we're all going to be equal here today. The game uses a ball that beeps. And a sighted pitcher calls out before and after the ball is pitched. Ready? One. There's no second base, only a first and third base. Where do you hear it? You hear that sound? Good, run! How do you know which base to run to? By hearing the same. When a ball is hit, one of the two bases randomly begins beeping. To score, the batter has to reach the base before the ball is stopped by an outfielder. I see in them a desire to be able to do everything and anything. Good job. They're very happy kids who want to just experience life and have fun. I felt overjoyed because I finally found a solution to my question. How could I play baseball? And it was standing right in front of me all this time. Did you ever think you'd be able to play baseball? Uh, I don't think so. And baseball is just the beginning. These kids are learning how to take a swing at success throughout their lives. My father always tells me, just because I'm blind doesn't mean I can't do what others do. Thanks to the Miami Lighthouse for the Blind and the Miami Marlins.